We're not gonna talk about that laundry in the back. <laughs> My name is Lindsay. Welcome back to my channel where I talk about theater, sometimes about like other pop culture stuff, but it's mainly about theater. If you're new to the channel and you like that kind of stuff, you should probably subscribe. Do it. Do it now. Now on to the video. So if you're a theater person yourself or you have friends who are in theater or if you follow other theater uh, content creators or other theater professionals in general, you have probably heard them talk about like their dream roles. I want to play Alphaba. I want to play, nah, what's his name? Evan Hansen. Whoo, close one. And you know, I have my own list of, of roles, but um, uh, but you know, how the theater industry is right now, um, I, uh, there, there are a lot of roles that I cannot play, uh, because I look like this. Various reasons why I cannot play certain roles, I am brown, I am overweight, I cannot dance, among a lot of other things. My dream roles, or who I could realistically play, is pretty limited. So I'm here to talk about all the reasons why there are certain roles that I can never, ever, uh, play, ever, at all. So without further ado, here are a list of roles in theater that I could never Ever play. So look, here's the thing, Regina George. I'm a non-Regina George type, look at me. And that and that is because I cannot wear heels. They'll scare me. I have weak ankles. I could fall over at any moment. Who wants to see Regina just fall forward during world burn? Next, Elle Woods. Look, I am not an Elle Woods type. Look at me, look at the lower bell bunny. And he, look, the reason why is because I have seen the search for Elle Woods. That aired during the prime of my life. I remember it very well. I don't have the stamina that it takes to play Elle Woods, so that could never happen. Next, Glinda. Again, I am not a Glinda type, and that's because heights absolutely scare the poo out of me. I know I have seen so many backstage videos of her just being strapped into the bubble and everything is fine, but you know what? I have trust issues uh, with various random objects. One of them is uh, uh, safety straps. Next, literally anybody in Cats, name any of them, could not play it. And you would think it's because like, oh, you know, she can't dance. I can actually, uh, cut a rug, thank you very much. It's actually because of the makeup. I have very oily skin, so by the end of the show, I would look like the Joker. Next, Elder Price in the Book of Mormon, which you would think it's because, you know, he's a dude, I'm a lady. No, that's not the reason why. It's because I don't look good in button-ups. Here's the thing, if it's button-up completely to my neck, no, I will look like a private school child, and I don't want to look like that. If Elder Price rocked a V-neck, I'd be mm, on board, I'd be perfect, but um, that is not the case. Like a cute, like, V-neck button-up, like I'm about to go to Bermuda, that, then, then we're talking. Then and, you know, Book of Armor producers. Hit me up. Next, um, either of the moms in Dear Van Hansen. You know, you would probably think I probably can't play that role yet because I am just too young. I have not hit that prime in my life yet. I actually could not play those roles ever because I am a glass case of emotion. So no. Next, Matilda. You know, that makes sense because, uh, you know, I am too old. I am 26. Matilda is probably five, six years old. But you would think that's the reason why. That's actually not the reason why. Uh, it's because the Russian language absolutely confuses me. But you would think, Lindsay, that's only one scene of the show. But you're right. It's a very important scene of the show. I'm not going to spoil anything if you haven't seen it yet. But Russian language, who has the time for it? Next. Next, any teen in Spring Awakening, any of them, all of them, and uh, you would think it's because, you know, the show is, is too sexual, I come from a, uh, you know, pretty uh, conservative upbringing, I don't consider myself conservative in that way, but the real reason why is actually because my knees would never forgive me. There's so much jumping in that show. My knees, absolutely, with the amount of weight that I carry on my body, could not handle that. There's lots of jumping, jumping on the ground, jumping on chairs, and you know what, I don't think my knees could handle that. And lastly, the Skylar sisters, any of them in Hamilton, now, you would think, Lindsay, you are, you're brown, you have uh, just a great vocal range and that's that I say thank you but actually you know what the real reason why is because have you seen those bodices oh 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 uh uh my body could not handle that so if someone came up or you know I could be in that show but you know what I would have to really just suck it in for three hours don't know if I could do that and those are the list of rules that I could never play in my entire life I hope you all enjoyed it if you did please give me a thumbs up let me know do you have any dream roles tell me uh in the comments down below I would love to know and again if you haven't subscribed to me already you can hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to be notified every time I make a brand new video I make new videos pretty much whenever I want so if you want to check that out uh on my YouTube channel great you should also check out my social medias as well I will see you all next time. Bye!